So, season 16 E Series Sports Sedan back. Woo! And we're all straight into it at Sandown Raceway, round one. Alexander Newton took pole, Simon Cox second, and Aiden KL third. There was a bit of uh, biffo on uh, turn two there at Sandown. It was getting a bit exciting. Some new guys were in the skid leader AMGs. But uh, Alexander Newton in the AMG just dominated. Um, he is a pretty good racer in real life, and um, he showed us all how it was done, and this is his first full season that he's going to contend. Uh, he had um, Aiden Kale there, though, in the supercar right behind him. We've adjusted these cars a little bit, and we're continuing to adjust them just to try and even them up best we can. Uh, but I think that's pretty cool. But an Audi, Mustang, 2009 Ford behind that, and I think there was a BMW and an AMG, so it's pretty cool. Some good, intense battles through the pack with the Cadillacs as well. Um, Kurt Bond and Colin Smith were both running the caddies and doing really, really well. So great to see. As you can see, some good battles through here with Cadillac, BMW and AMG. Tried to stick with, uh, well, we have stuck with uh, front engine cars for this uh, series. Some good battles. BJ there with uh, Aiden Kale going for it. And um, this, this fight went through pretty much the whole... Um, the whole day. So super exciting. It was a lot of fun actually out there. It was good to see um, a lot of the old boys back and uh, a few new guys. And we've definitely got space for people if they want to come and run. We've got nine more rounds. So uh, race one was um, an Alexander Newton uh, affair with Aiden Kale second, Brendan Jenner, Simon Cox, Daniel Hill, Rob Hill, Kurt Bond, Michael Falzon, me, Ram McClurk, and Colin Smith, Tony Dunn, Mark Pryor, and Adrian Pryor rounding out the top 13, well, the 13 runners. And that was the end of race one. So race two was a reverse grid with uh, Adrian Pryor on pole. So the Pryor brothers were. So it's going to be interesting with the quick guys coming through from the back. Uh, always spices thing and things up. We did do this in real life back in the day, I believe, at some rounds. Bit of action again with the new boys in the AMG. So not ideal, but um, they seem to be in the thicker things in this uh, round. Pryor was able to get a good run, uh, that's Mark Pryor, and um, he had people like um, Colin Smith chasing him down, Michael Falzon, and even myself. But as you can see, Alexander Newton was already coming through. That Audi is just such a weapon in a straight line, much like the real Audi in sports sedans. Uh, we've actually limited him a little tiny bit more going into round two, but um, it is a hard car to drive, so it's terrible under brakes uh, and through the corners compared to the GT cars. So we're trying to just sort of even things out the best we can. Things like the supercars have pretty terrible tyre life, so trying to give them a bit more power so they can get a break from it. Some good battles between um, Colin Smith here and Michael Felzon. Michael had a bit of a mixed bag. He was in a fair bit of uh, bit of biffo out there in this round. And um, Colin, as you all know, used to race the Smith Monaro and now is retired from full-time racing. And... Um, Ashley Jarvis is driving his car in real life, so that's pretty cool. Um, it's great having some real life sports and and drivers still in it. We obviously did have heaps in the earlier series, but um, that was in the lockdown world. So some cool in-car here. AMG chasing one of the supercars. That's um, Brendan Jenner in one of the 2009 Fords. As you can see, got a good run. And I think Jenner gets in front. Yep, there you go. Sort of a little bit, bit exciting one. That was it for the race two, which we had um, Alexander Newton take the win again with um, Kurt Bond in second, Colin Smith third, Brendan Jenner fourth, Simon Cox, Aidan Kale, Mark Pryor, Daniel Hill, myself, Adrian Pryor rounded out of the top ten, and Tony Dunn, Rob Hill, and Michael Felson. So that sort of led us to the final race. Yeah, and with Alexander Newton um, taking that win, he was on pole for the final with Daniel Hill and Brendan Jenner in third. We got away and it was a blinding start again by Alexander and made the Audi stretch to leg. So with um, Benny Roberts not here as he's doing uh, a Formula Series, I didn't realise on Wednesday nights, um, Alex has sort of got, got away. I think BJ's going to move over to the Audi, so it should be pretty interesting. But there was, again, a bit of biffo in the, in the mid-pack. Um, but... Overall, a great night. Hopefully, you guys get along to round two. Uh, that's in a few weeks' time. Um, yeah, get on and get involved.